one of the things that I have been working on is a big project that I will be able to reveal soon. And it is not a planner for next year because we did with Archer and Olive an undated and a dated, and I'm gonna be using the undated for the first half of the year, and then we will see about an academic planner for next year. But I also want to make a few more adjustments into my planner style, even though I've reached a very good level of planner piece with what I will show you today, which is a flip through, and I'll work through filling in some gaps in my planner, but I wanted to let you all know that if you're waiting on a planner for me or from me, you don't have to wait until, well, you technically have to wait until 2022, but maybe more towards the middle of the year. So that will hopefully go along with the plans that you've had for doing whatever you need to do. But I do want to share that I am going to be probably dabbling back into the Hobonichi and maybe some bullet journaling and who knows what other kind of creative journaling aspects I will tap into. I've been feeling really good about the planners, both this one for 2020 and this one for 2021. But as we all know, as creatives, we need to evolve and grow. And I think I'm going to be, I don't know, figuring it out. So I'll figure it out with the undated Archer and Olive collaboration planner, and then we will see what happens for the academic year in 2022. Thank you so much. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it, and I hope to be sharing more with you soon. Thanks for sticking around, and I'm sending you guys a big virtual hug, and I hope you're doing well. Can't believe we're over halfway through 2021. I hope that it has been, oh, mostly positive for you. I wanted to flip through and show you where I am with this and how it's going. I think that we all have been through quite a ride and though there were optimistic points throughout this year, <laughs> it looks like we're headed towards a fourth wave or third wave, fourth wave, I don't even know anymore. Uh, LA County opened up and then it shut back down. Not, not really, it didn't shut down, but the Delta variant is proving to be a doozy and the mask mandates have gone back into place, which is fine, but look, it says in April there is light at the end of the tunnel at last. Well, yeah, we thought so. So here is a quick little flip through. If you have any questions about the style or anything, then I am happy to go more in depth with you. I wanted to make a video with five of my favorite planner techniques so that you can see what's going on here. All right, here is where I need to catch up a little bit. Father's Day and so I'm a little bit behind. As you can see, I've moved into July, but there are holes. So let's finish off these last few days in June.
give it up, give it up, boy. Oh no, 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 you're never gonna get far. I think you're worth the fight like there's just a few more days of June but I really want to keep this separate because this is when we went to Atlanta so I'm not going to worry so much about that and finishing this off I hope you don't mind and I really hope that you've enjoyed seeing this quick flip through and finishing up of the first six months or almost six months of my planner and hope that you're doing well seeking inspiration and finding joy wherever you are i hope you're healthy i hope your friends are healthy your family and i will be seeing you very soon in another video give this video a thumbs up if you like it let me know in the comments below what you liked seeing best and what kind of videos you want to see in the future thank you so much I'm